I'm Teal Gardner. My residency at the Bemis lasted between July 2014 to mid-February 2015. I'm a play advocate and that gets into my art practice through creating objects for play advocacy and um, engaging people socially in that field. This winter I've started working more on creating objects for adults and children, anyone to interact with when they're just playing in the park or walking down the sidewalk. All of the typical kinds of uh, engagement with the city that you see people doing that don't even maybe seem all that notable, but I want to bring those out because I think they're really great ways of interacting in the city. So I just wanted to start providing as much uh, open space and actual materials for kids to do that. So maybe I'll get a big like neon or orange tarp that I think looks really fun. And then, you know, com combine that with um, cardboard and sumi ink and I don't know, loads and loads of string and duct tape and stuff. And then that all kind of amasses into this like collection of material that I think looks really fun and then via the children's use of it or the people's use of it, it turns into this kind of really interesting looking space that they create. It's usually me waiting for people to show up and I move things around and kind of just try to make the space look a little bit active. So I lay things out on the ground just so that they look scattered about and then when people come it looks like it's already sort of been started and then I just sort of ask a child if they feel like they want to try building something with me or sometimes just watch them. Sometimes a person comes and they just don't start themselves and so you have to say we should make costumes and then they can take that small suggestion and you know, run a, th a hundred miles with it. I like just being able to say, like, I got here to this play lab, I brought this stuff, but I don't know what you guys are gonna do with it. I had to get over being um, micromanaging. When I first started play lab, I was like, oh, it needs to look like something's going on here. Because as soon as I started getting all anxious about it and overactive myself, then, the point of it was basically lost. Urban Design Lab was a new program that the Bemis um, started putting together this year. Um, and it was based on the idea that high school students could become part of the Bemis. Um, they could basically be paid to be involved in our programming over the summer. I was paired with Chloe Bass, who has become a good friend of mine. Um, she's an artist from Brooklyn, and we were basically asked to create a class about urbanism um, rooted in Omaha. She was coming to the Bemis already with a project of her own, so I just kind of had to decide what my contribution was going to be, and I decided to use the network of people that I have in Omaha to create pretty much a curriculum around this city and then um, having the kids respond to those different lessons, I guess, with projects and culminating in um, an exhibition that ran through November that showcased some of their work. The Bemis entire staff pulled together to put on Urban Design Lab. I think I worked with pretty much everyone in this building at some point for that project to be possible, which was really cool. It kind of rooted me in at the Bemis for sure.